And the payload, you were talking about how you have the three cameras. What is the purpose of the, the two uh, EO cameras? Yeah, so what we've done here, think about it like what you have on a smartphone, for example, where on an iPhone, for example, you have different sensors and you're going to start very wide and then go through the different sensors to zoom in. Mm. Basically, this is exactly what we've done here. So we've put, two, we've put two RGB sensors, one wide angle, one telephoto, and the two together uh, allow us to do a uh, 32 time zoom and identify someone or something from 1.2 miles away. So this is very much the, the, the it's, it's very much a surveillance drone because you can actually see things very far. Right. Um, which is pretty unique on such a small drone. Like people are always amazed when they see the zooming capability of this product because because they think because it's small, it's not capable of zooming that, right. that far. But so this is what we've done with the two RGB. So the two RGB are like this. Um, and next to them, we have a thermal camera, uh, 320, a FLIR boson. Um, and this is obviously, as you very well know, mm. to do uh, thermal operations. So see at night, etc. do a bunch of things with the thermal. And what we do is that we blend both imagery, so the RGB and the thermal, which means that you can have thermal imagery all the way up to 32 times zoom. So at 32 times zoom, you're gonna be able to have the thermal imagery because it's acting as a layer on top of the RGB. Mm. We mix everything. Um, so that's the blending that we have. It gives, as you know, more context in what you're saying. 